departments, students, and very important, the young band of students from Balancen and Bisco. So much, uh, you know, uh, so much impressed by their, uh, you know, presentation uh, and the type of zest they had in this school uh, when they uh, gave their presentation of playing the band outside this uh, particular, uh, you know, convocation complex. Uh, when I talk of IOT Zukra, IOT Zukra is one of the constant college of our university established in year 2014. Uh, the way it has been established, no doubt, uh, you know, there are still many of the uh, hardships that the, uh, you know, college is facing, but many have been resolved and I'm very proud that our students are doing well. I just heard uh, just now that two more patents have been granted or filed or Two more patents have been filed or granted? Granted. So uh, the earlier one patent was granted. Now two more patents have been granted. So uh, I'm sure that uh, you know uh, Center for Incubate, uh, Center for Innovation, Incubation and Entrepreneurship is taking uh, a good lead in providing its uh, expertise uh, and when I talk of other activities of IOT, it's a very, uh, students are very hardworking and viral. They have run calls even in our sports activities. So I'm sure that even this one will be uh, very, uh, you know, uh, informative and very uh, type of uh, uh, gaining knowledge for them by going through the booklet that has been, uh, you know, taken out by the IOT pertaining to this particular fest. Uh, very important activities are there and very, uh, you know, uh, great personalities which have lots of acumen uh, in their field uh, and have contributed a lot to our society have been invited in. Some of these speakers are from outside. So now uh, I'm sure that our young boys and girls will have a good exposure in this uh, tech fest. And as Professor Ramsusa, uh, Dr. Uh, Sorokji and, uh, uh, you know, Dr. Sainkalji said that these tech fests, uh, you know, create a platform for our youth uh, to be connected with the industries and corporates, and it's a great uh, learning experience for them. Uh, and uh, I'm sure that uh, a particular type of vision is developed in them uh, in order to move forward in their life, not only in their academic career, but also in their professional career. In fact, cultural and tech sets are life of any uh, educational uh, institutes. Uh, they promote the interest of current technology among our students uh, and of course it bridges the gap between industry and practices. It provides an area for students to test their engineering skills and uh, to uh, connect uh, the students with groundbreaking ideas because of course uh, provide a platform for demonstrating uh, their skills. Uh, I'm sure that this present activity uh, in the long run will be very beneficial for our students, of, not only for the students of engineering, but also uh, it will open vision to our other students. And uh, waiting room, the idea came in my mind, NIT has expertise, human resource technology, university different type, our cluster university different type and we have uh, different type. Uh, hopefully, uh, you know, I will ask my dean academic affairs science. Uh, we gain for what purpose this particular fest has to be. And uh, we don't, uh, you know, we every year the responsibility can be given to a different type of issue so that, uh, you know, we have different uh, types of ideas in it. Uh, I think that way it will be very fruitful and uh, 
the type of uh, you know uh, techno uh, affects the object to which it has. For example, I said sports and agriculture, floriculture, different related uh, engineering skills there. And I think which ventures forward, I once again to the members and of course students who have worked so hard for this particular uh, fest. In fact, when I took over, uh, the idea was floated to the director IOT. Uh, we are a little late, but it's a little late, uh, better to be late than never. Um, I'm hopeful that next year during uh, summers we'll have a very big uh, techno fest in this university. And uh, definitely, uh, I don't have any uh, you know, doubt in my mind that we have excellent skill efforts where we have to provide any money we do where we have to approach the government for funding we do and uh, I'm sure in due course of time uh, our skills in our students will be developed and these skills will be used in their entrepreneurship and, the, and uh, I must say uh, that our faculty at IOT uh, is again uh, very hard working and uh, the director with the leadership of director and me uh, inshallah uh, we, we are very hopeful that in due course of time it will be one of the uh, best engineering colleges to be recognized in our country thank you